a full bow at 90 degrees from Liofu Village Amusement Park head Ye Jong-ye, as he confesses that the escaped baboon came from his park. His confession comes after multiple denials that any animals had escaped from the amusement park since the baboon was first spotted in the wild a few weeks ago. Ye said that the confinement facilities at the park are very good, and an initial count showed that no animals were missing, so he doubted that the baboon was theirs at first. However, Ye has been criticized for having changed his tune on the situation five separate times. Ye said that security measures will be strengthened moving forward. The baboon unfortunately died from wounds it sustained during its capture. An investigation revealed that the scars from the baboon's sterilization were a match to the technique used at the amusement park. It was only then that Ye confessed. Agricultural Minister Chen Ji-jong scolded the amusement park's authorities, saying that they did not voluntarily admit to violating the law. He said he has asked the Shinju County government to issue fines against the park. The Shinju County Forestry Bureau is also sending a monitoring group to take inventory of the amusement park's animals. Director Fan Wen Zhao bluntly stated that he could not be sure an inventory submitted by the park would be accurate. With both technology and management failing to ensure accountability, there will certainly be questions about the feasibility of such parks in the future. Chris Gorin, RTI News.